Stone Town, out the back of the MOT workshop is a courtyard, tiny, almost too small to fit one person, lying in shadow now, mid-morning, the walls made of luscious stone. I can hear them heating up in the May sun, feel the cool May air on my face and hands inside the armour of my biking gear. This town is full of corners where the stone meets doorways from the outer world, triangles of space or staircase feet where you can turn and climb but not much more, hidden nooks that bath you in their shade and give that little nudge of fear because they're so narrow like cave passages between limestone blocks. No one knows them all because they are countless, cool in the morning sun and fresh with recent dew. Their creamy corners sequestered from sight, their crannies tucked into the niches where dimensions hide, their mortar eroded to a pile of dust lying in the furrow between the hinges and the jam. The older the town, the more these nooks will multiply, the better they will be concealed. It is as if, it is as if the stone could fold itself to make more of them and keep them out of sight, their secrets properly preserved. Here's one which starts a ladder climbing onto the roof ridge, vanishing into another world over the horizon.